Why was Turkey reviving its ties with their rivals? So what was the main challenge faced by Thai Erdogan domestically? So Turkey's pragmatic shift in their foreign policy resulted in a major diplomatic out outreach. So now Turkey wants to revive ties with their rivals, the major rivals like Saudi Arabia and also the Israel and also in many Arab states. So the main reason behind the diplomatic outreach is Turkey's economic crisis. So Thai Erdogan facing a severe economic crisis domestically. So Turkey, uh, the inflation of Turkey soars up to 70% and also the oil price, food price were uh, record high and also the Turkey's uh, money, Lyra uh, hit record low against US dollar. So there are many challenges faced by Turkey domestically and also the Ukraine-Russia crisis fueled the tension further. So this is the main reason behind Turkey Thai Erdogan shift in foreign policy. Now uh, to revive the economic cooperation and also to import their goods which was restricted by their rivals. So now Turkey had a good relation, want to maintain a good relationship with Saudi Arabia, UAE and also uh, Israel. So Turkey's main enemy is Saudi Arabia. In case of uh, the uh, the head of the Islamic uh, Arab world, uh, Saudi Arabia is. So Turkey want to grab the position, the head of the Islamic world and uh, want to maintain the domination in the in this region. So Turkey in 2018, Jamal Khashoggi, the Saudi journalist Jamal Khashoggi was killed by the Saudis in uh, Turkey, in uh, Saudi consulate in Turkey. So this was the major breakthrough in Turkey and uh, Saudi Arabia relations because Turkey took this issue as a major issue and uh, filed many allegations against Saudi Arabia and Saudi Arabia uh, angered by the Turkey's act and then Turkey imposed various, sorry, Saudi Arabia imposed various restrictions of Turkey imports. This hit the Turkey's imports because uh, in 2019, Saudi Arabia, Turkey's export to Saudi Arabia is 3.2 billion American dollars and after in 2022, now the worth is only around 200 million American dollars. So the, the main economic problem occurred in between Turkey and uh, Saudi Arabia relations. This impacted the uh, Turkey's uh, economy. So now the the Turkish president uh, Tayyip Erdogan travelled to Saudi Arabia and he told that he want to transfer the Jamal Khashoggi case from uh, Turkey to Saudi Arabia and this cooled the tensions between Turkey and Saudi Arabia and they have uh, they have uh, spoken about various economic cooperation and now the reviving uh, ties between Saudi Arabia and Turkey had uh, cooled the relationship between both the sides and now the economic cooperation uh, nego negotiated between uh, the countries so there might be some projects uh, going on between the countries and turkey wants to revive cooperation with saudi arabia and other is israel so this is a major breakthrough because uh, turkey is supporting for the palestine cause and they are very much very against very much against the israel but now uh, after 14 years uh, a yeah, high level meeting occurred between Israel and Turkey because Israel's uh, President Isaac Herzog travelled to the Turkey and they have discussed, negotiated about economic cooperation and then natural gas transportation. Turkey made a proposal uh, to uh, transport Israel's uh, natural gas to Europe through the Turkey so that they can gain something. So this was negotiated and Israel considering the proposal of Turkey seriously and also West is also considering even though now uh, the Turkish relationship affected with uh, US and West but the Russia, uh, uh, Europe had a major uh, rely on Russia's oil. So now the Ukraine-Russia crisis uh, want the Europe to shift their oil focus towards other countries. So Israel's oil, Israel's natural gas is something uh, yeah, good for the Europe, uh, European countries and European Union. So now they are considering the uh, the oil uh, pipelines through the Turkey. So if they made, accepted the proposal, then there will be a good uh, profit for the Turkey. And the other is uh, Turkey's relationship with UAE and also Egypt. The Egypt-Turkey uh, relationship was uh, tension uh, tension occurred during 2013 when Egypt uh, coup was attempted by Al Sisi. Al Sisi uh, was a, a general and he was against the Turkey and Turkey was against the Al Sisi. So now after uh, seven around ten years, now uh, um, the Turkey want to maintain 
good diplomatic relationship with Egypt and they are considering to appoint, reappoint the ambassador and once again want to maintain a good diplomatic ties. So this is a new phase of Turkey in foreign policy and also Turkey is now close to the Russia other than the NATO and US. This is because in 2016 uh, US want to attempt a coup in Turkey by Fatullah Gulen and also the Usman Kavala case uh, which may, which uh, raised the tensions between the Turkey and US and also the Europe sides. So now Turkey maintained a good relationship with uh, good relationship within with uh, Russia. So uh, this uh, made this uh, made uh, Turkey to mediate talks between Ukraine and Russia because Ukraine and Russia are the main important partner of Turkey. If those people fighting against each other, then the, it will be a major. Uh, devastating consequences will end up in Turkey. So Turkey uh, maintain a, a big diplomatic outreach and a pragmatic shift in Turkey's foreign policy. Thank you.